EA Sports and the Web.com Tour proudly present second round coverage of the Web.com Tour Championship. A great way to start a hole nicely placed in the fairway. Looking to keep it going here, Frank. Yeah, another example of uh, things just working as they should. Now, this is not hitting in the right direction. You know, it looks like it's going to be in the rough. Into the tall cabbage. That ball is swallowed up. This requires a lot of speed through the ball. Solid play, heart of the green. Even par, apparently. Good, solid par right there. TPC Sawgrass, the fabled stadium course designed by the legendary Pete Dye. Rich Lerner alongside Frank Navalo. Here at the 8th, Frank, most players are happy walking out of here with a par three. And the reason why, it's a very narrow entry to this green. It's just littered with bunkers around, left, behind, to the side, and even short. Uh, once you get further up the green, though, even though this is sort of an undulating green, it starts to widen up. So don't get trapped into just looking at the front of this hole. Made par yesterday. This one for birdie. Speed wasn't bad on that long putt, but the read wasn't very good. Well, it's that sneaky distance. All right, good putt. The rhythm of that stroke. Didn't try and bash it in the back. Frank, now at the ninth, this really is one of my favorite par fives in the entire sport. And uh, I certainly enjoy watching people play it today, Rich. Uh, used to be unreachable, but the longer hitters now, uh, we're starting to see them go for this par five regularly in two. And the reason why, they start to hit the drive more down the right now than what they used to. People used to try and go down the left side. The right side, it hugs the water, but you get a better view of the second shot. Frank, this is a position where a player is absolutely licking his chops here. Good chance to make a birdie. Yeah, this is when this game just looks like fun. Bunkers don't seem to be in play. The only thing you're really looking at right now is just the flag. Frank in a bit of trouble here at the par five, missing the green on that third shot. Yeah, just battling to make par. Um, and this is going to be difficult. This one just requires a little bit of focus. Good putt. Frank getting set now for one of the more exciting back nines in all of golf right here at TPC Sawgrass. And it starts at 10. It looks like a dog leg to the left, really, but you've got to play it as a straightaway tee shot. The run out, just over 310 yards. That's in the fairway. Frank, where's the difficulty on this approach here at the 10th? It's really the shape of this green. Um, that little front piece, uh, you have to be right on the money there. And then, of course, that green starts to open up and then move to the right. Getting set for this next shot from the rough, what does the player need to be careful of here, Frank? Well, this is where we're going to see exactly how good they are because, you know, that's not exactly the best lie, but it's sort of doable if, if you know what you're doing. And from the rough, he manages to not only make the green, but get within easy striking distance of the hole. A good effort, a good par putt. 
All right, hole number 11 here at the TPC Sawgrass, 558 yard, par five, no shortage of options, no shortage of hazards, Frank. If there's one hole at TPC Sawgrass where you can literally leap out of your shoes, this is it. And the tee shot ends up in the bunker. Miss the fairway in the fairway bunker now. It's not all gloom and doom though. Lip isn't too high. A good swing here still shouldn't be a problem. So the golf ball ends up in that first cut. It's a little bit less than two inches. You can see the golf ball should be able to get at it, but may not be able to control the spin. We'll see. That one is bunker bound, it looks like. And he's in the sand again, unlucky. In the greenside bunker here, Frank. Nice to go to the beach, but not too often, we hope. A beautiful, soft touch out of the bunker. That's Mickelson-esque. Shouldn't be a problem here, but not a formality either. That was a good-looking putt, just not falling right now. You know, sadly, he's going to be disappointed. So a tester from four feet. And he has it. A good putt redeems all. Down to the par 4 12th, and it's a pretty short hole, Frank. Yeah, Pete Dye often doesn't get enough credit for his short par fours, though. This is a great example where one of the features of it is the blind second shot, just to give you a little bit of doubt on judging the distance. Frank, really good chance from this position to make a birdie. Yeah, really, the only thing he's looking at right now is the flag. Uh, this is a green light special. Here's to be what they call a commercial play. Very solid. Early part of this back nine and a good approach shot. And now we'll have this for birdie. See if he can go one better than yesterday when he made par. This putt for birdie. Well, after that, birdie has to be feeling as though they're not out of it just yet. We're not far away from the first page of the leaderboard. A couple more birdies. Don't forget third round coverage coming your way tomorrow on EA Sports. For Frank Navalo, I'm Rich Lerner, saying so long for now.